Continuing with the Poverty Pony Pistol Budget Blaster, the upper is complete, ordered off of Grid Defense, has a $20 red dot off of Amazon, along with $11 backup Canset Iron Sights. Got the Anderson lower off of Gunbroker. The pink doesn't really match up. It shows up better on camera, but in person, the upper is much darker. The arm brace was 3D printed by Tactical Scales. He has a podcast with Terribly Tactical called Shooting the Poop podcast and i got the palmetto state armory lower parts kit off their website with a promo code for 79 dollars. i don't i don't think that was including shipping but we're not counting shipping or tax or anything because i think i paid more for the transfer fee and the shipping for this lower than i did for the lower itself picking this up for 30 bucks off of gunbroker winning it on a bid if you could imagine not a lot of people were interested in a um pink lower but I'm going to go ahead and put the lower together. Not really going to do a how-to, just throw it together and then show you guys the finished product. I won't take it to the range today. That'll come later, but this essentially is the build. And this is under uh, $450, just under. So I don't have money for a sling or for any other accessories. We'll leave this as is. At some point, we'll go to the range and zero that red dot, see if it even holds zero, and we'll go from there. Here is the final product. It is three different tones of pink, but it should be functional. We'll take it back out. I did scuff the this section right here, pushing that pin in, uh, because typically I don't put masking tape on the lower because I'm really not that worried about the finish. But because this is essentially some uh, someone's custom work that they put on Gunbroker, um, the finish isn't that great. I'll have to ask my girlfriend for some nail polish or something to you know cover that up. Uh, but yeah uh <laughs> it doesn't look good but hopefully it's functional and uh in a later video we can see what the other guys put together for under 450 dollars we'll take to the range again slide in that red dot see if it even holds zero and then i can also try out the backup iron sights there also and just see if it functions properly that is it for this video thank you guys for watching